Today on Household Hacker, an oldie but goodie. Drinking glasses made from beer bottles. We'll start with a little Tupperware container and place it on a sturdy countertop. Next, we've got to get a flammable liquid, and we're going to be essentially weakening the bottle's integrity with fire. I'll be using isopropyl alcohol, which is easily obtained at a grocery store. Now, if you don't have any empty bottles, then this next step should prove to be quite fun. Drink a beverage of your choice and place the bottle near the container. We're just going to need a little bit of string now. I'm going to use some yarn I found in my grandmother's basement. We're going to go ahead and cut off enough string to wrap around the bottle probably three or four times. Then we're going to soak it in liquid for a minute or two. Now while it's soaking, go ahead and grab another container or just use your sink and fill it with cold water. You might drop some ice in as well. Once we ignite the bottle, we'll be placing it into the cold water bath and it'll help separate the bottle into two separate pieces. Now all you're going to need to do is slowly and carefully tie the string around the bottle and make sure that it's snug and secure. Once you're satisfied with your knot, simply ignite the string and rotate the bottle around until the flame burns out. I highly suggest doing this near water to stay on the safe side, though the flame isn't much more than sort of like a big candle. Once the flame burns down, place the bottle directly into the water bath, and if you did it right, it should split into two pieces. To get it split right, it might take some practice, but since we have the modern invention of sandpaper, it can typically smooth out any rough edges and make this into a drinking glass that'll last for a long time to come. So bottoms up and have fun. Just remember, keep it safe and wear proper protection when handling flames. We'll see you next time. <laughs>